Tiffany here with The Party of Six. Today we're going to go over the comparison between homeschool versus public school and some of the things that we love about them. If you are here for the first time, I am a homeschooling mom of four. We've done homeschool, private school, public school. So make sure that you subscribe so you can see more videos like this and our adventures and then hit the like button and then how about we comment with one thing that you miss most about all of this stuff from COVID. So for example, I miss hugs from friends and going to church and watching my little girl hug the princesses when she meets them at Disney. Can't do that stuff anymore. So let me know what you miss most about all of this COVID. So let's get started. Number one, less stress less stress about getting them off and up and awake and off to school, less stress about homework, about what they're gonna wear, all of those stressful things and who they're going to be interacting with and all that stress. So much more peace in our home now. The relationships are better. That is a huge one. Our relationships with our kids, our family unit is stronger, our family time is better. It has been such a good blessing for our family. Number two, no homework. When our kids were in school, it was such a stressor. They were gone all day, I missed them, they missed me. The last thing they wanted to do was homework. And by the time you got everything done, there wasn't any time for family time. Now we get lots of family time and we love it. Field trips are awesome. So you get to decide what field trips you wanna go on and how you can use a field trip to supplement what you're learning and help your kids. One awesome one that we did was a blueberry farm. The farmer took us out and showed us the different types of blueberries and it was so much fun. They got to taste blueberries and taste blueberries that were different. They had no idea that there were different blueberries. Disney World, we've done a couple field trips at Disney World because it is an amazing place. Epcot, is fantastic. A lot of the different countries represented there. And you get to show them the different cultures. And that has been awesome. Magic Kingdom, they have the, the Hall of Presidents, which is awesome that you can go see. And there are different artifacts in there that you can go and visualize. And that's so good for the kids to learn in different ways. And so that was a supplement. That was an amazing thing that we got to do. So those are just a couple of the field trips that we've taken since we've been here. And field trips are awesome. School. Time for school. Homeschool. Yes. Another thing that we love is that I get to pick the curriculum. I pray about it, I research it, I look into it, and then I make my choices. And if it doesn't work, then that's okay too. And you just pick something different. And sometimes you pick something for one kid and then you pick something for another kid. And that's okay too, that's the beauty of it. You get to decide what is best for your child because no one knows them like you do. You know them the best and so you know what it is that they need. If you have one kid that is excelling and doing really well, then you can move ahead. If you have a kid that's lingering and maybe isn't quite grasping a concept, then that's awesome too because you just wait a little bit and maybe you give it a little a week longer. You make sure that they get it before you move on because it's all building blocks. All of it is building blocks and if you can get the foundation, then you can continue to build and continue to succeed. As a homeschool mom, you get to play all the different roles, which could be a pro or a con, like the principal, school nurse, Better. I'm hungry. Thank you for my lunch. You're welcome. Lunch lady. Teacher. Janitor. Cool to play ball. So we sat in the house. We did nothing at all. My favorite, being a mom. So all we could do was sit, sit, sit. One of the differences between homeschool and private school is when your kids are gone all day, you they come home and you ask them about their day and ask them about their friends. And that's kind of a double-edged sword because I found that our boys, they didn't want to talk. They wanted to play and get dirty and go outside and see all their toys that they missed all day. So it was really kind of like pulling teeth to get them to talk about their day. Um, 
So what I have done is, because we're together all the time, other than when we do co-ops and things, what I have found is that I started making up questions that we would ask one another and go around the whole table together at dinner time. And it's everything from, if you could pick any job at Walt Disney World, what would it be? What was something kind that someone did for you? You can find all kinds of things on Pinterest or just start brainstorming and just write them down. And so we have a paper that we keep near our dining room table that has all of those questions on it. What about socialization? What about PE and music and all of those things? So in public school, all of those things are provided for you. Well, the homeschooling community is really awesome. Our park offers homeschooling PE that we go to every Tuesday at 10 a.m. You have a yard, you go and run. You go to the park and you go and run. You can certainly teach your children how to bounce a ball or to throw a ball or to kick a ball. You can do all of those things. There's things on the internet that you can find. Totally doable. One of the things that is really cool about homeschooling that we love is all of the opportunities that you have out there. So one really cool thing is that you get to pick. There are all these different co-ops and classes that you get to choose from. So the library offers lots of different classes. Everything from the twins and uh, mommy and me time and toddler reading up to uh, science classes and that kind of things for the older kids. So you just have to do some research and find out what is offered in your area. Make sure that you subscribe so you can see more videos like this and our adventures and then hit the like button 